it's time to reorganize the yarn stash. Again. Yes, I know, I just did this, but that was in July, and it's now March, and it needs help. Exhibit A, bin of leftovers. My desk has a pile of current projects on it that need to be put into their own project bags. <laughs> um, I got another pile of stuff that I need to clear out. This insanity in the front it needs help. So I got some stackable clear acrylic bin things from Target. I got three different kinds. So we're going to see if those help and work. I've got a pegboard for my, for my cords here. And that's what I've got planned for this mess. So let's get to it. just over two weeks and I have made zero progress. <laughs> um, it was then spring break and then we had family in town and I've done nothing. Um, I've started. As you can see, there's, there's things up here with stuff in them, but it, it needs some help. So, I figure if we do that, um, like tap to clean thing on Instagram or just like snap, um, then it'll get done. So should we try that? Okay. Count of three. One, two, three.
I got it done ish. <laughs> um, as you can see, there has been some changes in the yarn. Um, I got rid of a bunch on purpose. <laughs> the teenage girls at church were doing a service project and needed yarn. So I donated, um, a giant Joann's bag full of yarn and I could have given them more, but I figured that was enough. So that's some of my stash gone. Um, that definitely helps for my stash busting <laughs> for this year. But um, the cubbies have stayed the same. The only difference is what I did up top. So let's take you through it. Okay, so I got these acrylic things from Target. This one holds the embroidery and cross stitch stuff. Um, these can probably go in a cubby. This has little um, notions bags, stitch markers, safety eyes, whoops, buttons, my DPNs, uh, my interchangeables, and those things. Um, here's my neck light. That's my one pair of straight needles. I should probably get rid of those. And then these are organized by weight. So this is the fingering weight. Um, so sock yarn and lace weight is also in there too. This one is leftover bulky. This is sport and DK. And this one is all worsted weight. Um, as you can see, I need to start using up some of my leftover sock yarn. Um, yeah, so. I got plans for that. Um, just got some tuft woolens stuff. This smells divine, by the way. And then I have this pegboard up here. This, I also got this from Target. This is all of my crochet hooks. This has a bunch of random things. So that, I have safety glasses in there for some reason. Um, pom pom maker. This is my fixed circulars that are the carbon fiber ones, the Knitter's Pride Carbons. These are the cords for my interchangeables. Um, this holds more buttons. Okay. Um, this is my fixed circulars for the Endless Steel, which is all Chiagu, except for this one, which was Addy. And then this is fixed circulars for the wooden ones. These are Knitter's Pride. Um, these ones are the basics, and I think these ones are the dreams. So I'm very happy with that needles thing going on here. Um, that was adorable. I did this on one Saturday, not too long ago, and this one also on a Saturday last week. <laughs> so that is my decorations for now. Um, I flipped around the desk. I did have it originally flat against this wall, but I wanted to move it and now it, it works better. I recently finished that crochet blanket. Um, more on that later. I got this peg hook thing from Target, so it's got project bags in it, on it. This is current project, current project. Everything else is waiting for me to start. That's a drawing by one of my children. Um, then I've got stuff underneath, um, church bag, dog is barking, fun. Um, so there's a basket full of well, I was going to say current webs, but they're not current. I need to figure out what I'm doing with those. Um, to make, to make ongoing empty bags, um, my blocking mats. This corner is where the Swift and Ball Winder will be. Well, they are currently being used downstairs. And then here's my lingering whip <laughs> and all my patterns, pattern books. Um, 
So we got Star Wars, All Harry Potters, Lord of the Rings, sweaters. I love thrift books, by the way. These are all Expression Fiber Arts. These are from everywhere else, and they are full, and I need more. Um, these are just adorable. I've got Bernadette in here. Um, Charming Colorwork Socks. I know there's a second book coming soon. I'm excited for that. Um, I need to get the second one. Volume 2 of 52 Weeks of Socks. So we got sock, sock, sock. <laughs> yeah. Um, thrift books, thrift books, thrift books. I picked up an Alice Starmore at the thrift store. Um, thrift books, thrift books. I think I've got a problem with uh, thrift books there. Anyway... All right, so I am pretty happy with this new setup. Um, we'll see how long it lasts until I change something again. Um, yeah, so I, I like how I have my ends, my ends, the leftovers um, organized by yarn weight in drawers. So much easier that way. I like my little peg wall thing holding my soon to be projects that are worked on no projects that are soon to be worked on yeah something like that um especially this one this one is the one intended to be done for our anniversary at the end of may it is the middle of march um this is done in fingering weight so i should probably get started on that that's my next thing to do start on that yeah okay so i'm gonna start on that and we will see you next time. Bye.